Situated along the Aravalli Hills, Udaipur is Rajasthan's mesmerizing city of lakes that attracts travelers from all over the world. Udaipur is steeped in history, having been founded by Maharana Uday Singh II in 1553 as the new capital of the Mewar Kingdom. A beautiful palace shimmering on the calm waters of Lake Pichola is an iconic image that is associated with this quaint city. Udaipur's rich architecture and overall romantic ambience make it ideal not only for honeymooners but also travellers looking for an exquisite experience without leaving the country. Interestingly, the city packs in a punch for backpackers and solo travellers given the fact that it is a hotspot for foreign travellers. If you are seeking romantic views and ethereal monuments, we highly recommend this heritage destination. The best time to visit Udaipur is from November to February which constitutes the winter season. During this time, the days are sunny and the evenings cool, making it perfect to venture out into the city for sightseeing. The shoulder season in Udaipur is the monsoon from July to October. This is a good time to visit if you're looking to travel on a budget. Since the temperatures are relatively lower, rainfall is scarce and hotel tariffs also drop drastically. Udaipur receives the least number of tourists from March to June since summer is at its peak. You may see the temperatures going as high as 45 degrees Celsius. Because of the low tourist population, the hotel and flight rates hit an all-time low. However, sightseeing can be extremely uncomfortable due to the heat. With a seductive old world charm, opulent palaces and lively bazaars, there are a plethora of places to visit and things to do in Udaipur. Visit the pristine Fateh Sagar Lake for a lovely walk to watch the sunset. The Fateh Sagar Lake is the most popular hangout place in Udaipur. It is flooded with youngsters buzzing around the coffee shops and fast food restaurants on the lakeside. Take a walk through the city palace and understand India's rich history and culture. Enjoy the light and sound show at night and the crystal gallery. Enjoy a lake ride on Lake Pichola. It is the centre point of Old Udaipur and is famous for many restaurants situated on the banks of the lake. The Karni Mata Temple is famous not just for its religious value but also for the breathtaking view that it gives. This place gives you an amazing view of the city of Lake Pichola and of the city palace. The Sahelio Kibari is famous for its lush green gardens, colourful flowers and marble fountains. It is therefore one of the most popular tourist attractions in Udaipur. The garden has four water pools, chiseled kiosks, marble elephants, a lotus pool and many bird fountains. The Sajjangarh Fort is famous for its sunset view and it also has a wildlife sanctuary at its base. This fort will give you a 360 degree view of the city with two big lakes and vegetation surrounding the gorgeous city. Ambrai Ghat is another place where you can enjoy the serenity of this beautiful city and simply sit back and chill. The nearest airport to Udaipur is called the Maharana Pratap Airport which is situated about 20 kilometers from the city centre. It is well connected by air to all major Indian cities including Delhi, Mumbai, Kolkata and Jaipur. If you're wondering about your budget for Udaipur, budget travellers can make do in about 500 to 1500 rupees a day. For mid-range travellers, it can go up to 1600 to 3600 rupees a day. And for luxury travellers, you can spend 6000 rupees a day and beyond. Banjara Hostel Hostel Udaipur, Ghost Stops Udaipur, Hostel Crawl, Mustache Hostel Udaipur, Gypsy Child Lake Hostel and Bankyard are great options for budget travellers. The Trident Udaipur, 
Madri Haveli, Hill Garden Retreat, Zeed House, Hotel Devraj Nivas are stays that you can check out if you're looking for a hotel. The Oberoi Udaivilas, the Taj Lake Palace and the Leela Palace are ideal for a truly luxurious indulgence. Some of the best places to enjoy a meal in Udaipur are Restaurant Gateway, Jagdish Temple Intersection Hawkers, the Millets of Mewar, Cafe Satori, eatery stalls at the Fateh Sagar Lake, Natural View Restaurant and Palki Khana. Your trip to Udaipur should be at least for 3 to 4 days to cover the beauty and serenity of this place and enjoy some lip-smacking Rajasthani dishes. Some people call it the Venice of the East, while others consider it to be a glorious example of Rajasthan's valour. Udaipur is a city with a mysterious and infectious charm that stays with you long after you've left. If you're looking for more such helpful guides, check out more videos from Tripoto. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel to be notified of our latest uploads. See you soon.